sabak. Hello, children. Today I'm your English teacher, and we will talk about the time, days of a week, and daily routine. Please listen to the poem. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, our teacher. We are glad to see you. Daily routines. Examples. He wakes up. He has a shower. He gets dressed. He brushes his teeth. He has breakfast. He goes to school. He has lessons. He has lunch. He goes back home. He does his homework. He plays with his friends. He goes to bed. Phonetic exercise. Early to bed. Early to rise makes a man healthy, wealthy and wise. Look at the Sally's daily routine. What does Sally do? She gets up in the morning. She goes jogging in the morning. She has breakfast in the morning. She goes to school. She has lunch in the afternoon. She does her homework in the afternoon. She has a cup of tea in the afternoon. She works on computer in the afternoon. She does a shopping in the evening. She eats dinner in the evening. She watches DVD in the evening. She goes to bed in the evening. So, what do you do in the morning, in the evening, in the afternoon? Asking about telling the time. Half past is 30 minutes. A quarter is 15 minutes. What time is it? It's 12 o'clock. It's half past six. It's a quarter past five. It's a quarter to seven. Prepositions of time, the time, three o'clock at noon, at plus midnight, at night in the morning, in, plus the afternoon in the evening. Example. Prepositions of time. The time. Three o'clock at noon, at, plus midnight, at night in the morning, in, plus the afternoon in the evening. For example, at three o'clock in the morning, at midnight, at noon, in the evening, at half past six. Listen about the daily routine. I get up early in the morning. After my morning exercises, I wash my face and brush my teeth. I usually don't take a shower in the morning. Then I have breakfast and go to school. After school at 2 o'clock, I usually have dinner. Very often I help my mom 
about the house. I sweep the floor, go shopping and wash the dishes. My day is over at 10 o'clock in the evening and I go to bed. Tell about your day, please. For example, my day begins early in the morning. What you do first? What you do in the morning? What you do afternoon? What you do in the evening? Let's talk about week, about days of a week. Monday is the first day, again, Monday. Tuesday is the second day, Tuesday. Wednesday is the third day, Wednesday. They are working days. Thursday is the fourth day, Friday is the fifth day. Saturday and Sunday, six and seven days, are weekend. Uh, look at the transcription of these words. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So, let's answer the questions. What day is between Sunday and Tuesday. It's Monday. Second, what day was yesterday? Yesterday was Friday. What day is between Tuesday and Thursday? It is Wednesday. What day will be tomorrow? It will be Sunday, our weekend. What day comes after Thursday? It is Friday. What day comes before Friday? It is Thursday. What day comes before Monday? It is Saturday. Make questions and make the dialogue. Use the, these words what you see. You, what, time, what TV and do. And our question is what time do you watch TV? Second. Next words. What, you, time, have, breakfast and do. And our question is, what time do you have breakfast? For example, I have breakfast at the 8 o'clock in the morning. Next, you what time go to bed do? And our question is, what time do you go to bed? For example, I go to bed at 11 o'clock in the evening. Next, what time you do go to school? And our question is, what time do you go to school? For example, I, like a teacher, go to school at 12 o'clock afternoon. And our lesson is over. Thank you for attention. Goodbye.